Vitamin Vitamin E is an antioxidant vitamin that protects cells against free radicals. Free radicals may be produced by things that can harm cells and tissues including pollution, cigarette smoke, sunlight, and more. The term vitamin E describes eight different compounds. Alpha tocopherol is the most active one in humans. It is fat soluble and can thus be stored in the body. Good sources of vitamin E include wheat germ oil, sunflower seeds, almonds, hazelnuts, and peanuts. Vitamin E exists naturally in eight forms, four tocopherols and four tocotrienols. The tocopherols are best known and have received much more research attention than the tocotrienols. Alpha tocopherol is the main type of vitamin E in the body and is probably the most important and the most often studied. Gamma tocopherol is the main form in food. Nut butters are good sources of vitamin E. A nut butter is a spreadable foodstuff made by grinding nuts into a paste. If you are allergic to nuts, smaller amounts of vitamin E are found in safflower oil, sunflower oil, broccoli, leafy vegetables, and spinach. Antioxidant Vitamin E is an antioxidant. It may help protect your cells from damage. This essential nutrient occurs naturally in many foods. It's also available as a dietary supplement. Sometimes, it's in processed foods. Vitamin E is fat soluble. This means your body stores and uses it as needed. Researchers have investigated the use of vitamin E as treatment for a variety of degenerative diseases, including hardening of the arteries, high blood pressure, heart disease and cancer. Measures It is measured in milligrams or international units, the latter are used on supplement labels. The daily recommended dietary allowance, RDA, for adults is 15 milligrams, about 23 U. The upper limit is 1000 milligrams, about 1500 U. Deficiency Deficiency in vitamin E is unknown, except in people with rare genetic disorders or malnutrition, or in preterm infants. Some people with bleeding problems or who take drugs that may increase bleeding should discuss with their doctor about avoiding high levels of vitamin E that may increase their risk of bleeding.